a hobby box opening of 2001 Topps Gallery. I've had this, I'm guessing I've had this for at least a year. Um, been sitting on the shelf, just kind of waiting for Breeze to retire. And uh, now that he is, you know, it's still been sitting there. But I figured I'd go ahead and crack it open. The, the Breeze base rookie card from this really really looks nice i like the the artwork on the card uh it's pretty simple but yet it's got that canvas uh look and feel to it so i don't think i have uh one of the base rookie uh breeze from gallery anymore what up sam yeah i figure you know maybe we'll start doing some of those uh throwback series we've done a few of them i think in years past but it's been a long time and like i said this has been sitting up here for at least a year um on the shelf so i figured i'd go ahead and and get it going oh what up gene just another collector you're not just another collector to me buddy <laughs> so anyway i hope everybody's had a great week tomorrow hope to see you guys at four o'clock starting time for auctions and breaks we have legacy select mini helmets uh luminance uh, all kinds of stuff up and ready to roll and we'll have a lot of great cards as well what up Bert? and that luminance i think has 12 or 13 spots still a lot of great teams pick your team um, style half case, so six boxes of luminance. So 24 hits is going to be in that thing. So that should be a lot of fun. You get the, uh, since I know pe when people get in here, they're going to, they're going to ask what teams are left. So I better be on the ready with that. Yeah, I got everybody's packages out. Whew. That was uh, a lot of work, but made it happen. Over 60 packages I delivered to the post office today. Not just bubble mailers. There were boxes and bubble, uh, flat rate bubbles and stuff. So it was a lot, of, a lot of work, but we got it done. I thank you guys for all those breaks that we were able to do the last couple of weeks. <laughs> Mikey Dots, what up, buddy? All right. Here we go. Um, just so I've had this for a long time, and I've just been kind of having it sit on the shelf. I really like the artwork cards of this. Again, this is the all painted base set, so it's pretty cool. Uh, two thousand one tops gallery. So you're looking what. Michael Vick rookies, Ladanian, Steve Smith. Oh yeah, Drew Brees. <laughs> so it was, it's some good stuff in here. 24 packs, six cards per pack. And uh, I've had this for at least a year. You can get autos in this and relics, but it's tough. And um, I figured I'd go ahead and crack it. I was going to wait for Brees to retire and he's been retired for a while. So think i'll go ahead and give it a shot i'm just kind of honestly been kind of a little bored today i thought we were going to be able to do luminance tonight but we have not yeah this is the 2001 and the the breeze card in here looks really really sweet in fact i was just looking it up being honest uh, I was just looking it up because that's a card that if I pull it straight out of it, uh, I'm, I would like to get like SGC or something. So let's see. Drew Brees, SGC, Tops Gallery. No, is man, Luminous is not sold out. It's crazy to me. Oh, 
Oh yeah, I better put 2001. There we go. So this is, that's what that card looks like. Yeah, it was good, man. Thank you. Thank you. I was hoping I was going to have a bigger picture. There we go. And I've had that card in the past. It's just awesome looking. I've had that card in the past, but I think I have sold it. Um, so it'd be cool to get another one and maybe get that integrated. Oh, yeah, of course there is. I'm home now, brother. So we'll have auctions and breaks. Got this for a really, really great price. So I wanted to, I couldn't pass it up. 2001. I look for past years uh, a lot of times for myself. Um, and, uh, you know, is this just a rip or a rip and sell? No, it's just a, just a rip for me. You know, one day these probably become available. Use this sticker when completing your set. You can put it right on the front of your binder or on your box. <laughs> $10 for the sticker. Who wants it? <laughs> Top sports trading cards. All right. But the box goes for decent money. I think it's around like 250 or 300 bucks now. It was I want to say it was right around 100 110 when I got it at some shop. <laughs> so again, 24 24 pack, 6 cards per pack. All painted base set. What up, Bo? And then tops, of course, they do um, the odds. So let's see what our odds are pulling an auto. Not very good, I think, out of this kind of stuff. Star Gallery inserts, 1 in 8. Gallery Heritage, 1 in 12. Team Tops, 1 in 5. Those are the ones that you're going to see more. Overall signatures, 1 in 84. So you're looking at like 1 in 3.5 boxes, basically. But, like I said, I don't really care about the auto. I'm just trying to get the uh, Drew Brees rookie in this. See, these cards are really, really cool. Just the artwork is really neat looking. And they're not canvas. They're smooth. But... It looks like the canvas art, right? The oil-based painting. So, really cool looking. If you haven't seen these before, maybe you're a newer collector. So we have Tiki, Stephen Davis, Donovan McNabb, Eat Your Campbells, Curtis, My Favorite Martian, Tim Biaka Batuka. And then here's the rookie cards. Here's Anthony Thomas. And then the checklist. So again, there's some there's some decent rookies that came out of this year, right? So we'll see. And I guess, you know, second year Brady in this. Joey Galloway. Not DJ Brown. Jamal Anderson. Troy Aikman. Nice card. Has the artists here. Bill Schroeder, done by DJ Brown. A Ronde Gadson. And a rookie this time. What up, Connor? Is going to be Lamont Jordan. <laughs> she manga. Lamont is a terp. Uh oh. <laughs> 
So yeah, the breezy in a in a ten goes for well over one hundred and twenty dollars. I know I don't have that Jordan. Uh oh, we'll auction it off. Battle between you and <laughs> and the Terp, Junior Seo, Fred Taylor, Isaac Bruce, Sylvester the Cat. He said, fight me, Sam. Peter Warwick. Oh, there's a first round pick gone bad. 2001 Tops Gallery Football Auction. Ooh, look at that. They're going to do an auction. <laughs> look for these original pieces of art on eBay from September through December, um, 20 years ago. <laughs> Bruce, I'll get that to you this weekend, my brother. And then Rod Gardner. I'll just dump a whole bunch of stupid Rams cards on you. I got to call the course tomorrow, too, so we can set a tea time. Okay, I'll be quiet. When you leave, I'm going to be talking again. A set builder's masterpiece. Kay McNown, Marvin Harrison. I'm like, huh? I Killyard, Randy Moss. He got mossed. We got here Sonny Jurgensen. Little bronze foil. Check that here. And then do we have an insert? Oh, a Randy Moss insert. Star Gallery. Cool. That'd be nice. Star Galleries were what? One in eight? Yep, one in eight on Star Galleries. Um, these <laughs> the shine off that overall relics one in 40 overall autographs one in 66 actually um, trying to see what uh, what those other ones were their team tops or our uh, gallery heritage All right, Mikey. See you, buddy. Hmm. Pretty cool, though. A little bronze foil, different than the regulars. Well, the only cool thing I'm really hoping to hit is just a Breeze rookie. That's it. Everything else would be just icing. That's my goal. Jeff George. T.O. Steve McNair. Tim Couch. Uh, money is not a Tuma. Quincy Carter is the rookie. And then another checklist. So again, up on the website now, we have teams still available. Oh, there you go, Burke. Trent Dilfer, Super Bowl quarterback. Donald Hayes. What up, Caleb? Peyton. Nice Peyton. Chris Chandler. Keenan McCardale. And Rudy Johnson, rookie. He <laughs> said, nice Trent. This has just been collecting dust on the shelf if you just got in here. Been collecting dust on the shelf for over a year. So I figured might as well open it. Charlie Garner. Mark Brunel, quarterback coach for the Lions. The hell's Brent Favre doing here? There's our first Lion of the Box, James Stewart. The Edge. There's that football auction preview again. 
And Josh Heifel. Big time Oklahoma. <laughs> Poor man's Drew Brees. There you go. Keep that far safe. Burn him. Derek Mason. Oh, just a yard short. Jermaine Crowell. There we go. Thousand yard receiver. Rob Johnson. Night is man. Must be seven o'clock already. <laughs> Christian's daddy. Derek Alexander. And Steve Smith rookie. Okay. Well, there's one of the there's one of the good rookies. Not the one I'm wanting, but it's not bad. I would even settle for a Ladanian Tomlinson or a Michael Vick. But I would really like to get the breeze. John Kitna is in a Lions uniform, but he's a Bengals card. Pride of Central Washington University. Yeah, these are all painted. Yep. Daryl Jackson. Wayne Corbett. But overrated. Sean Jefferson. Yeah, these cards look amazing. I've always liked them. One of the reasons I got this box is because I really like the Breeze card from this set. Brian Greasy. And then here's one of the another one foils. This is I think these are the Heritage. Jim Brown. Base card retired players, 144. Okay, that's what it is. It's not the heritage. So there's the base and the rookies and then the retired set. So like an SP because there's only, how many are in there? Only five. Only five cards in the retired set. So pretty cool. A set builder's masterpiece. Let's see. Collect all 144 base cards and receive card 145 upon presentation of your set to your HTA store owner. I wonder if I have the whole set, if I can go in there to a card shop and be like, hey, I have the whole set. Where's card 145 for me, please? Card 145 is Joe Namath, by the way. So really, there's only four cards in these boxes that are retired players and i've got two lamar smith that's because nobody wanted joe namath enough in these packs so they didn't put him in the packs you had to collect the set if you if you really wanted him that's why nobody's like nah i'm good jamal lewis aaron brooks and dan morgan first round linebacker if i remember With only one rookie card per pack, there's not a great chance I'm going to get the Breeze. <laughs> there's Horn, Troy Brown, Super Bowl Hero, Burline, Cole Pepper. <laughs> oh, there's the Heritage one. And then Marvin Snoop Minnis. Nice. Little great iron or uh Herod gallery heritage of Jerry Rice. Always a good insert. What's up, man? James Allen, Terry Glenn, Akili Smith. There you go, big cat. Emmett Smith. 
Emma. Here's one of the Star Gallery inserts, Mike Anderson and Kevin Casper. Um, Steve Smith rookie. These are these are all oil ba uh, painted cards, which I think are really cool. Uh, Jerry Rice insert and a Star Gallery, Mar uh, Randy Moss insert. The only card I'm looking for this uh, out of this box, if you didn't, if you didn't hear earlier, is the uh, Drew Brees rookie. Tom McNabb based him. That's the best. That's been the best one. Not close enough, big golly, I wish. I figured, like I said, I figured tonight uh, I would be opening a half case of Luminance, but doesn't seem like that's going to happen. Keyshawn Johnson, Vinny Testaverde, Tori Holt, Cordell Stewart, Musin Muhammad and the Michael Vick rookie. So that's still a, a cool one. Who let the dogs out? Pretty nicely centered. I think the Michael Vick in a 10 that goes for like 70, 80 bucks. So we got the Steve Smith. We got the Michael Vick. Still looking for the LT. And the Drew Brees. Who else is in here that I would like? Reggie Wayne? Okay, that's not bad. Um... Chad Ochocinco. <laughs> and that's about it. The other ones, I do not care. Jeff Garcia. Jimmy Smith, really good receiver. Kerry Collins, huh? Ricky Williams. Hey, pass it over here, bro. Here's one of the retired players. Nice. Walter Payton, SP. So there's only one more of those short print uh, Hall of Famers to get. Tony Gonzalez. And there is no rookie in that pack because it was a Hall of Famer. Any birds besides Nia? Yeah, there were a few. I think there was like a, what? What was his name? Deuce Staley? Here's two birds. There's a bird, Chad Lewis. Let's see what was his stats at that time. 69 catches. Hey, that's more than Mike Williams had. Eddie George. Charlie Batch. Drew Bledsoe. And nice, we got the Ladanian. Very cool, very cool.
Yeah, his cards do well too. About a hundred bucks in a ten. I think. Huh. That would be the second most expensive card in this set behind the Breeze, I would imagine. Hall of Fame running back. Tim Brown. David Boston. Eric Moulds. The Murderer. Erlacher. And Jesse Palmer, the Bachelor rookie. Start calling him Jason Voorhees. Amon Green. Marshall Falk. Jeff Graham. The Bus. <laughs> Jay Fiedler. And rookie Corel Buckhalter. So overall, I've uh, I've been pleased. Haven't gotten the the breeze, but it's still been good. I got the second, third, and fourth best rookies in this set. Probably number five would be Chad Ochocinco. Brad Johnson, Elvis Gerback, Tyrone Wheatley, Rod Smith, him and McCaffrey were beasts, Doug Flutie Flakes, and Algie Crumpler, rookie. Tim wants that cornhole buck halter. <laughs> Last six packs, see if we can find him. Oh my god, Elvis... In a Ravens Juni. Is that tough to find? Tim Dwight. Hey, that was, the, I was going to say, hey, that was the trade. Yep. <laughs> that draft day trade. Plummer. Jerry Rice. Chris Carter. Jeff Blake. And another Hall of Famer. This one is the Bart Starr. So now we got all four of those short print cards. Robert Smith. It's a good back for them. Heinz Ward. <laughs> Nate, nice again. Charles Johnson. There you go. There's an eagle. What was his stats? 56 catches, 642 yards, 7 touchdowns. Still better than Mike Williams. Kevin Johnson. Kevin Barlow is the rookie. And we have an insert. Chris Carter, star gallery. Not bad, not bad. You can't say nah when it's true just because you don't feel like it. Sean Keen. Ricky Waters. He had some good years. Corey Dillon. He had some good years. Rich Gannon. He had like two good years. Oh, we got an auto. We were not expecting an auto. <laughs> and it's Jet Lady 80's favorite dude. The reason why he names his channel that. And the Todd Heap rookie. Ooh. Nice. The Wayne Krabet oil painted auto. <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. And that is an on card auto.
from Wayne Corbett. Three more packs. Best card right there. You probably have that one, huh? Tiki Barber. Steven Davis again. Curtis Martin again. Tim Bianca. We're going to get doubles, of course, because it's not a huge set. Troy Aikman and... Freddie Mitchell, rookie. Man, so this has been pretty good and fun box. Okay, cool. Again, the, the pictures are just awesome with the oil-painted cards. McNabb, Galloway... Bill Schroeder, Rondé Gadsden, oh, there's one of those heritage cards, Y.A. Tittle, and then Cornyn Robinson, the rookie from the Seahawks, nice Y.A. Tittle from the 49ers. Both of the Heritage cards were 49ers, the Jerry Rice and the YA Tittle. And the Tomlinson comes back a 10. That's 100 bucks right there. I'm definitely happy with the box. Jamal Anderson. Say how he go. Sylvester Morris. Oh, it's going to be another short print Hall of Famer. Oh. That's interesting. And then another Sonny Jorgensen. Football Bucks Gallery Auction Issue. This note is legal tender for all Tops Gallery Auction original artwork. Wow. Wow. That is pretty cool. There'll be some uh, collector that will want that. All right. Hell, there might even be some collector that wants that. <laughs> I'm rich. See, you should have used that currency, Sam, to get some of that artwork back in 20 years ago. Very cool. Okay, now let's break luminance. Okay, cool. Buy out the rest of the spots, and we will for sure, my brother. We will for sure. See, people people always want me to do PYTs, but this is why I don't typically. Because they don't understand it's so much harder to fill PYTs than it is random teams. I know they like it more because you can get your own teams, which I understand. But it's so much harder to fill those. Oh, definitely. It's like 13 spots, brother. Uh, I'm going to put the Jim Brown bronze in a loader. Walter Payton. Sonny Jurgensen, no. 
Bart Starr, yes. So that ended up being pretty cool. We weren't expecting an auto, like one every three boxes or so. Rookie card of LT. I think I might end up getting that graded just because I think it looked great in the SGC slab. The Vic, I could care less just because who let the dogs out? Randy Moss insert is always nice. Jerry Rice insert is always nice. And then the Steve Smith, a few bucks. And the biggest cards, of course, were the James Stewart, Jermaine Crowell, and Charlie Batch. Can't go wrong with those guys. <laughs> All right. Cool, cool. Yeah, also on the site, we have the Serpentine Break of Select. Um, I don't have a Break of the Legacy up right now because uh, we have the Luminance up. But um, And then I don't have that because I was just going to be a personal for somebody if they wanted one and then i have one other box of select for like a personal or something but that was a cool little throwback throw back the clock there turn back the clock throw it back we have other boxes here too that but those are more junk wax stuff like Opening day, 1988 football. <laughs> 1988 football box. Go after that Bo Jackson rookie next. Maybe we'll do that next Thursday. I'm sure you get at least one of them in there. What, 36 packs, I believe. Those are funny now. Those are a hundred and ten dollars a box, pretty much everywhere. Hundred and ten, hundred and twenty dollars a box everywhere, and there's one sitting right up there, <laughs> like, and I got it for under twenty dollars, like probably ten years ago. Hey, AK La Pendeja, what up, brother? Probably at a swap meet, I think I got it. I'm like, oh, it'd be cool to get a Bo Jackson. <laughs> and now things are stupid. Speaking of stupid, Aaron's here. Welcome, brother. But yeah, Luminance is nice. It's on the website. Um, I got one break with... Uh, pulling the pros, and I got a uh, Hawkinson patch. Um, I got the Barry Sanders flash insert. By the end of next week, I'll have my Barry count updated. Then I got a Rakeem Boyd. Monroe St. Brown, Sage Surratt, Jamar Jefferson, <laughs> and another Sage Surratt. So I got those. Um, From a pulling the pros break. We've got a lot more hits that have come in this week. Got these. The uh, PSA 10 Acuna rookie update. Um, three of the SGC 10s. Tatis rookie debut. The SGC 10s there. I figured those were a couple of, of good uh, graded 10s to hold on to. Yeah, Sage Surratt is a lion. Yeah, he's a UDFA. <laughs> Give me Acuna.
Um, let's see. Just because we have people still here, let's open one of these and see what's in it. And then I'll be... We're going to have to open two. Dang it. Because it will have odd numbers then. And I would do these for box battles. <laughs> Oh, okay. Be surprised. We'll save the uh, Mega Box packs till the end. Yeah, you guys can share that uh, that breakout on Twitter, Snapchat, Facebook, and Instagram. I'd appreciate that. I think the prices are super good, especially considering that I did not get these on pre-order price and they're still lower uh, for a six box break than most people's, most to all for six boxes. Oh, nice. <laughs> Yeah, UDFA. They say he has a chance to make the roster, but you know the Lions receiving core is not very good right now. Um, so with these, I know like if you look there, Justin's like, what the heck is that stack? So all of that stack is veteran base um, and prospect cards from Bowman. So all I do, and I have a lot bigger stack than that, of the rookies and first Bowman and Chromes and inserts. But so I put that aside, but like the trout, I just throw it aside. And then I keep the, the Chromes and the firsts and all that kind of stuff out. But if this was like Baron Laura, who was one of the best uh, pulls in, in Bowman last year, it's a prospect. So if this was a paper, I would just throw it aside and be like, eh, whatever. I don't pull it out. Like Cody Hosey prospect. Um, you know, it's not a first, so I just put it aside. So those are my, my two different piles. So if you want to like Dominguez and stuff, I just throw Dominguez off to the side with the rest of the stuff. I don't set them out. Daniel Lynch, Gilbert... Oh, do you? I well, I know I have uh, multiple base sets. I don't, I don't put them together, but I know there's multiple base sets in there. See, like all these are prospects. I'm like, ah, I just put them with the regular stuff with the with the veteran base too, because they're not firsts and they're not rookies. Ten, sixteen, and sixty-six. So it'd be better if I knew the names. Magical's a rook. Crochet's a rookie. Waters is Chrome, Cavalli is Chrome, Doreen Pagano Lofton. 10, 16, and 66. You're talking veteran base, right? Not like Bowman Prospect set. Because they could be rookies in that case. Okay. <laughs> What's up, Joby? He's Garcia, Sixto Sanchez. I didn't even know I was in a break. I was just telling Tim and those guys. Adele, Spencer Howe, and Kim Brian Hayes. Yeah, I know I have them all. Yep. <clears throat> Two of those. Well, I don't know about Spencer Howard, but Kim Brian and Adele, of course, are the, are the are the nicer ones. Antonio Gomez, first Bowman Chrome. Schmidt, rookie. Nico Rips, rookie. And Andrew 
Christine, Madrigal, Crochet, Asa Lacey, Tucker, Laura, Detmers. And see, like Dominguez, he just goes in the other stack. Hey, <laughs> man, I wish I could do all that, like, sport betting or whatever the heck it's called, sport kings or whatever with you guys. It'd be so much fun, but I can't do it in this state. Torres, Blake Snell, you garbage. Tariq Scooball. Zach Veen, Bowman Chrome. Use Neil Diaz. Shane Baz, Langoliers, and Tana First Bowman. I forgot them both. You would have had to wrap. <laughs> Is it just because um, you picked that helmet? Is that what we're talking about? <laughs> Never calls me. I don't call anybody. I message people. You want me to message you? Like I don't I don't call anybody. I probably would call people more if I was like, I don't know, 60, 70. No Troy. <laughs> well, if you need to know about golf, then you can hit me up there, Neff. We do video calls. We can do video calls. <laughs> what are you doing with all the keep cards? Oh, all the keep cards? Like these? Like Chrome and all that stuff? I don't know. I thought about Fire Cell. I take them to the show sometimes. Like I have... Um, back there... Let's see. That stack is hits. The three stacks behind that Bowman stack are all basketball cards um that are good that is all bowman um i think that is hoops premium the one back there is hits the one in between those two that you can't see is bowman and then these two are baseball out here people are looking for that veen card just the base chrome one that's weird. I got a few of them, I imagine. All right, let's see if there's anything in these mega packs. The Mojo. Mojo. See what Brayson would have battled me with. Okay, no numbers here. Miguel Amaya. Forrest Whitley. Key Brian Hayes, Rookie of the Year, Mojo. Patrick Bailey. And Mackenzie Gore, Mojo. We have four more of these that I can let him battle me with. Oh, there's going to be a blue. Hopefully that'll be an auto. Tyler Soderstrom, Ed Howard, another one of the Cabrian Hayes Rookie of the Year favorite mojos, Bryson Stott, and J-Rod, Julio Rodriguez. <laughs> and then a purple. There's Neek. What a stupid first name. Even kind of looks like him a little bit. 
not just because he's brown. Nick Gonzalez, Trent Bill Bev DeVoe. First Bowman Chrome, Mojo. Heston Kierstad, first, or not first, but Mojo. Wander Franco, Mojo. Yeah, see, Wander's I just throw off to the side too, but this one, obviously I won't because it's Mojo. And then a Yankees prospect, Anthony Volpe, out of 250. This is actually kind of cool because I just I just learned that uh, Carter and him are friends. Oh, that's right. Why former USA Baseball 18 national team plan to attend Vanderbilt? Okay, I was like, I just found out that that uh, this kid and Carter are friends. I just learned that this past week. So that's kind of cool. Maybe I'll give that to to see why. He's back in town now. So maybe I'll give that card to see why. He might like that. Okay. Here's a first Bowman Chrome of Alexander Ramirez. First Bowman Chrome Mojo Aaron Sabato. Uh, Hunter Green Mojo. Matthew Liberator Mojo. And for the Sox, Yorbert Sanchez on card out of 150. Yorbert, you get in here, Yorbert. I think I have his auto already. That name sounds familiar. Yorbert Sanchez at 150. Hold on, I might. I might just have it over here. It seems like I just got that card. There's some things that just came in recently mixed with some other stuff. Oh, I think this is who I was thinking of because <laughs> they're both Chicago White Sox guys. DJ Gladney, third baseman, first Bowman, auto out of 99. And then Yolbert Sanchez out of 150. Oh, okay. Maybe that's why. <laughs> Just for a minute. I'll be back on um, Xbox in a minute. Oh, yeah. I found this the other day. Just going through a random box. This is actually a pretty valuable card. White Sparkle. Rookie. Uh, Topps Chrome. Carlos Correa. Rookie update. It wasn't. It wasn't even sleeved, but it's still in really great condition. Hmm. Anyway, that's that. CFCY wants that card. If he doesn't, that will be available. See if that Yolbert is any good. I gotta see if uh, Scotty Aranya has this one. I'm sure he does. Yeah, we're opening 2001 Topps Gallery Box. And then I decided to open a couple of mega boxes of Bowman Cat. 
Oh yeah, it's so fun, so fun. Uh, I still have a lot of boxes to go through, like fifty or so, forty or fifty or so of those. Uh, oh no, I'm probably around thirty or forty. I'm guessing of those uh, collection boxes that I I haven't gone through in forever because my garage obviously was was like a hoarder lived there, but now it's all cleaned out so I can get to my stuff again. So, anyway, um. Yeah, I opened a few things. Um, tomorrow, 4 o'clock, hopefully you guys can come in and hang out. Share it on your social media, please. Retweet every retweet all the stuff for everybody, not just me. Capital P, my friend from the Northwest, is also having an auction. At his is at 4.30 on YouTube, Capital P Cards. Um, we talked tonight a little bit, and you know that's the, that's the only day he has off. And I, I don't care. You don't have to ask my permission. Nobody owns a day except for the man above. And so... Um, you know, and so he'll be going live. I'll probably have his stream up on here and uh, show you guys some cards that I know that some of you guys follow their teams. And then um, and then we'll have our stuff in here as far as breaks and, and auctions and stuff. Nice. Um, anything I'd like in them. <laughs> uh, Peter Work. You like that Peter Work card that we pulled? Uh... So, you know, we'll, we'll be up there and, um, you know, we got, what, 13 spots, I think, left in that half case of luminance. Uh, I think there's 12 spots left in the select serpentine draft, two boxes of that. Uh, seven spots left in the next two boxes of mini helmets. We do have, we do have four of these bad boys, the, the platinum style. Um, but we can't get to these until we fill the rest of the case of the regular ones. So, and then we also have the two boxes of Legacy that I'm not sure what we'll do with that. But that'll be a fun night tomorrow like last week was crazy. So, um, but yeah, tag everyone on Twitter. You know, don't let anybody tell you don't tag me and all that stuff. You know, they, psh, just ignore them. Uh, I got those last week with my box of Stadium Club. It's just four boxes, though, from Southern Hobby. So it wasn't, it's not a big deal. It's not, it's not from, from TriStar. That's from Southern Hobby. So. Oh, yeah, the, yeah, the Keely Smith, Peter Warwick. Night, Duffy. Love you, brother. Still hope uh, you make it happen so we can go out and hang out. You know, we're having a Saturday night. Uh, barbecue smash and mini will be there so hopefully you have a chance to come down too and hang out with us me big d for life justin alex um dustin abraham and blake bobby mad and crazy titans fan a lot of people man is going to be there it's going to be a lot of fun um you know hopefully you're able to to hang out there nico will be at our at our lake house tuesday and wednesday night staying the night um you know and and if anybody comes in early to the national chicago Tuesday, yep, yep, I will. Um, Tuesday night, we're all going to the Cubs and Reds game, and that got that got little messages out there because I got a message from Great Lakes Breaks, uh, and they're gonna they're gonna try to get bleacher seats also and make it like a party atmosphere. So the more the merrier. Uh, remember Thursday night in Chicago is baseball collector Mike's party. Friday night, the Lowe's Hotel in Chicago will be the party hosted by me, Papino Man, and Filmington. So that'll be a ton of fun. That's at the Lowe's Hotel in Chicago. And uh, that's going to be a party all night long. If you were there last time in Chicago, it was a blast. So we are, what, 12 days away until I'm in Chicago. So we fly out on Tuesday morning. So it'll be... A ton of fun can't wait to see all my friends um you know the cards are great but the but the people are better so until tomorrow guys love you all stay safe and take care everyone